All right, so this is a Honda Pilot 2008. Um, this is the next gener generation uh, of the Honda Pilot. I'm just gonna show you the, the style. So the common problems I had with this car was uh, evaporative um, emissions, stuff like that, uh, check engines, um, P, such as P145C and uh, P0497, stuff like that. I also have a check engine code because uh, the banks cylinder banks were deactivated and um, I'll put the uh, code numbers down below so what I did was I changed if you have the emission problems it's usually this one this is the purge uh, evaporative um, solenoid or whatever it's called uh, I changed this one uh, I also on each bank I changed the uh, VTEC solenoid this this one here and there's not another one here I changed both of them because I the check engine showed bank one and bank two so i decided to change this one and and this one right here you see it's brand new this one here yeah you see this one's shiny this one i changed um i also had a chance because um the car was drinking oil and gas so i changed also the uh, this one here it's just down below it's right here yeah this one here you see this one is a 10 mm i also changed this one so it's basically a oil um what is it called this is called a pcv valve it's a long rod that goes into the the head and uh, this one was a bit difficult because um when i remove it it broke in half so i had to use uh, some screws a lot of uh, penetrating oil and then slowly dig it out every uh, plastic piece out but otherwise if you don't live in Montreal or harsh winter areas it should should be come out in one piece exactly this piece here down there this one here this is the purge and PCV valve I also changed this one and um, and guess what no more check engines everything is fixed uh, another common problem I had with this uh, Honda Pilot should be uh, the same for Honda Rich Lines stuff like that is the the driver's side there was no ac um and the passenger side and the back had ac so the problem was if you're trying to fix this um it's the shutter valve for the door so this moves back and forth whenever you select the temperature and uh, it closes and it opens the valve at uh, the, the door for the ventilation on your driver's side and this one was not moving at all, so I changed it and now it works perfectly. So it moves whenever you select the temperature. Uh, same thing for the other side, there's another one on the other side. I changed both as well. So, so that's it. If you have any questions, just leave a comment down below and I hope uh, this quick guide and quick help will help you sort things out easily. So now the car has no more check engine. Uh, Echo mode is back um, because this car drinks a lot of gas uh, the fuel consumption was heavy the oil consumption was also heavy so hopefully the ch by changing the pcv valve will solve the problems but now the customer is very happy because he has the eco mode back so it should be the same for the honda accords uh, honda pilot uh, honda ridge lines and even the acura mdx it's all basically the same car with the same engine just different uh, layout and different chassis so thank you guys for watching if this helped you out, um, please like, uh, click the like on the video and maybe subscribe for some more tips. Thank you guys. Have a great day.